coming down. Now, this, of course, is the plane carrying relatives of Sara Sharif, the 10-year-old girl who was found dead at her home in Woking. Uh, the father, her father, Erfan Sharif, her stepmother, and also her uncle on that plane that is travelling down to Gatwick Airport this evening. Sarah Sharif, the 10-year-old, found dead at home in Woking, and it was after her father, Erfan Sharif, uh, made a 999 call from Pakistan. We can talk now to Ivor Bennett, who's covering this story for us. Ivor, what's likely to happen when that plane does land? Well, I think there'll be a flurry of activity um, on the runway. There already has been, in fact, um, a convoy of police vehicles with blue lights has been seen um, driving onto the tarmac, and we expect, so the moment these three members of Sarah Sharif's family walk off that plane, we expect them to be met by police. They have been wanted for questioning connection with the 10-year-old's death for weeks, ever since her body was discovered at the family home in Woking on August the 10th. They have been the subject of an international manhunt after they um, went into hiding effectively in Pakistan, and a manhunt involving authorities here, there, and also Interpol. What prompted them to board this plane now, um, having boarded a plane um, early this morning from uh, Pakistan and changing in Dubai, that's not entirely clear, but we understand they made this trip of their own volition. Um, but as I say, we expect them now to be met by police and questioned, questions that police have wanted to ask for the last four weeks. That's after they launched a murder investigation following the discovery of this 10-year-old girl's body at the family home just over a month ago. A post-mortem examination revealed that she had suffered multiple and extensive injuries. There have been um, comments made by the family um, uh, to various outlets, including Sky News, um, her stepmother said she would be willing to cooperate with the British authorities and we understand they will now be speaking to them as soon as this plane touches down in the next few moments. You can see that plane there going slowly down to Earth, going down to Gatwick Airport. Police vehicles, we understand, have arrived at the airport just after 7pm today. And, of course, on that plane that you can see there, that Emirates flight, three members of the 10-year-old's family, Sarah Sharif. They're on the flight back to the UK from Pakistan as the plane there touches down on the runway. People on that plane, her father, Irfan Sharif, his partner, uh, Sarah's stepmother, Bainash Batool, and also her uncle, Irfan's brother, Faisal Malik, all travelled to Pakistan and they're now arriving back in the United Kingdom on that Emirates flight. Police at the airport. Now, we're going to be bringing you more on that story throughout the programme, of course. Uh, the plane arriving there in Gatwick Airport, Sarah Sharif's family members arriving at Gatwick, and we'll, of course, bring you any updates on that story uh, as we get them. Now, would you rather dirty rivers or fewer homes being built? It's a difficult choice, but the Lords have tonight voted down an amendment on government plans to...